temps here at the ground are in the 20s, but in New York, especially northern New York, there's a little bit of warmer air up above, so that's why there's at least a little bit of mixing on the front edge. I don't think it lasts too long, the mixing that is. It'll eventually flip over to all snow. We do have snow in Middlebury and Rutland, not quite in Burlington or Plattsburgh, but it'll be there very soon. You can see that uh, on Storm Tracker, it's lifting north. So if you're watching from Newport or St. J, just given another hour or two, should be snowing soon. In fact, on Futurecast, it's really between now and about two o'clock tomorrow morning with the heaviest snow. So it's a very front end oriented system for the heaviest snow, about three or four inches with that. And then through the day tomorrow, just patches of lighter snow. I could see it letting up for a little bit tomorrow morning or really at any point tomorrow. And for an interstate, I mean, if a plow goes by, put some treatment down, it might even turn kind of wet for a little bit, but I think wake up time, it'll be snow covered. So how much snow? Generally four to eight inches. Mount Marcy might get eight plus. And as we drift over to northern Vermont, uh, the Green Mountain Spine from Sugarbush Point South should be at least eight inches of snow down into southern Vermont, including Mount Snow. So the call overnight has us falling below freezing, the snow moving through and intensifying, roads becoming snow covered everywhere. And then tomorrow we're actually a little above freezing. So that's why I think it'll turn out to be kind of a medium impact through the day. Snowy in the morning, not so bad as we get into the afternoon. And as you see on the 10 day forecast, we've got sunshine penciled in by Saturday afternoon. So Saturday's dry, Sunday actually dry, but turns out cloudier. And then there's a storm that really zips along, mostly to our south on Monday. So we're thinking there'll be more snow, but the farther north you are, it might not be very much on Monday, more so a southern thing. And then Wednesday and Thursday of next week, we've got a third storm to talk about. So we will be busy here in the weather department. It's good that we've got Andrew aboard.